UNC Charlotte's Venture Program started in 1974 and has been serving the most adventurous 49ers ever since. A team of communication studies students recently set out to tell the story of the program. My name is Sandy Cohn. I'm the director of the Venture Program at UNC Charlotte. So the Venture Program started in 1970 with a grant that sent a group of faculty, staff, and students from UNCC to the new Outward Bound School, North Carolina Outward Bound School that had started just a couple of years e um, earlier. Um, they came back from that three-week trip saying this was an amazing experience. We need to make this available to students on a regular basis. The Venture Program has grown tremendously um, since its origins. Um, I got here in 1984. When I got here, we were doing about 24 trips a year and about 24 challenge course programs a year, and that's about all we did. Um, now, we still do about 24 trips a year. Last year, we did 350 challenge course programs. We added a climbing wall that had another about, 100 and, about 120 programs. Um, and also, when I came, we were doing, teaching one academic class, and now we teach 10. And we just proposed an academic uh, minor, which will provide a whole new avenue of, that's new from what we used to do. Uh, my name is Matthew Chewy Johnson, as uh, people like to refer to me, and uh, I've been with Venture for three years now. My name is Anna Pisani, and I've been with the Venture program since November of 2008, so approximately four years. The reasons I see people come out to the wall a lot of times is to have a good time, to experience a new adventure, or to just build community with fellow classmates. During my freshman year, I had the opportunity to sign up for a rock climbing class, and Venture runs that particular class. I've grown a lot just in learning about myself and learning how to interact in community, um, as well as other team building activities. The whole idea of Venture is provide experiential learning in the outdoors. So we try to get people to get involved with our program. We try to get people to go through our course so that way they can find ways to push their own boundaries throughout our different activities that we have. My name is Juan Acosta. Uh, I've been with Venture for a little over five years. I'm a senior. The main goal for people that come out to our high ropes course is to uh, just have a very unique experience, whether it's a personal growth experience or a team building experience by giving them uh, an opportunity to be in a very unique uh, atmosphere such as the high ropes course. Groups and teams, when they're out on the ropes course, um, it just gives them a very different uh, experience than what they're used to. Uh, if they're a team and they're just used to being uh, in a field or in a game, being out on the ropes course allows them to uh, kind of challenge themselves a little more and kind of trust uh, each other more. Participants, when they come out here, they have a very unique, well, they have a very established fear of heights sometimes, uh, and then just a, a lack of trust in uh, the gear. So they start on this ground level right here, this first level, which is around four feet off the ground, and it's very, it's not hard, it's not difficult. Uh, and then we move on to the second level and the third level, we are there to talk them through it. We are there to uh, explain to them very rationally any fear that they might have. So we're not going to push people too much, uh, but we are going to challenge you to push yourself to a, to a limit. I'm Vincent Selzler, and I've been involved in the Venture Program for about two years. Typically, the people that participate in the program are often international students, and we also run what's called the first adventure trip every semester, all for incoming freshmen, which is another group of people who tend to build together and participate a lot in the program as well. On trips, I would say we develop skills having to do, of course, with outdoor skills. You learn to kayak, maybe learn to rock climb, learn to backpack. That's a set of skills I would refer to as the hard skills. But then there's also a set of soft skills, learning with dealing with people and working together. I think it's unique in the sense that maybe on a team building course or something, you would do that, but it's in a very deliberate sense, like we're coming here just to, to team build. Whereas when we're out in the woods, you know, we're all cooking dinner together, we're all working together to get things done. And so working together comes in like a natural way or a more, a more uh, 
just a flow, a, na a natural flow. It just comes along. Okay. The venture experience on campus and the venture experience off campus, they tend to differ because you really build a sense of community with the people that you have to sleep with and cook dinner with and be with for a longer period of time. And you're not just sort of cramming yourselves together just to be together, to work together. There's a real natural environment for you to build a sense of community and work together on the trips. My name is Brian Capron and I'm the Associate Director of the Venture Program. Different groups come to venture with different kinds of needs. One of those needs is the amount of time that they can spend with us. The freshman seminar programs are either uh, like an hour and 15 minutes long. And so we have created a program style that is able to provide a good mobile activity program within that hour and 15 minute time block. Typically, when a group comes out to our Low Ropes Challenge course, we work with a matter of approximately three hours. And so we have a lot more flexibility with the kinds of programming that we offer. And the High Ropes course experience with us takes somewhere in the neighborhood of three, three and a half, or four hours, depending on the size of the group. So time constraints are one of the things that can dictate the reasons that we choose the kind of programming that we do. So the one thing I want students to take away from the Venture Program, I think, is a greater sense of themselves, about who they are, what they're capable of, and also um, more of a sense of ownership about the decisions they're making in their lives, uh, more of a sense of responsibility about this is my life and I can shape it the way I want it to be, um, rather than just sort of going with the flow or sort of being pushed from one thing to another really taking control of one's life. Um, and I see that happen a lot with our student leaders and um, also with the students in our academic classes. I think that's the biggest gift that we give to UNCC students. Mm -hmm.